Hi, I'm Rich with Inside HPC, and I'm here at Beijing. We just concluded the uh, GPU Technology Conference here for 2011. Uh, some of the highlights from this week. First of all, they uh, opened up the code for CUDA, and this is available for select uh, researchers and developers with NVIDIA. So I think that was a big step. Um, secondly, MSC Nastran is now available for GPUs. I think this is a big step. Um, Nastran has not been a code that has scaled well beyond maybe 4 to 12 processors in the past. So putting it with the vector instructions on the uh, GPUs I think is very significant. That's highly used code in industry and good luck to those folks. And then finally uh, we went and saw the Tianhu system, the number two supercomputer in the world here in Tianjin about uh, three hours away. Yesterday we saw that and I spoke with the director and I asked him if he thought that uh, China might develop their own GPUs sometime in the future just as they have done with the Sunway Blue Light supercomputer that is now number 14 on the top 500. Uh, he said that um, China does have a significant history of developing their own processors. Um, in fact, they developed a streaming processor that was used on the mole system that we went and saw uh, the day before that at the National Academy of Sciences. So he said he would not be surprised if China developed their own GPU someday. So that's it from the GPU conference in Beijing. This is Rich Breckner with Inside HPC. We'll see you next time.